Hi, today we're going to talk about The Punisher Meets Archie from 1994. The Punisher Meets Archie is a 50 page crossover special where The Punisher goes to Riverdale on the trail of a criminal and he meets Archie. Let's have a look at the book and see where um, this goes. So with this, you pretty much get what you pay for. Uh, the Punisher turns up in Riverdale with microchip in tow, and he's on the trail of someone who looks very much like Archie. Uh, you see them go to Pops, where there are gangsters, and you see the bad guy who looks like Archie going out with Veronica, taking him to a dance, taking her to a dance, I should say. Um, and the inevitable mix-up of identity occurs where the Punisher goes after Archie they quickly find out that there's um, been a mistake made and then they all go to the dance after the criminal. What's funny about this is you get to see the Punisher in this unusual environment and the Riverdale characters reacting to him such as the massively ineffectual police force that they've got against the Punisher and the Punisher going to the dance pretending to be a school teacher where he just sticks out like a sore thumb. <laughs> you, you get a, basically a chuckle a page with this, which is fine. I mean, there's no thought of big laugh out loud moments. It is just chuckles. Um, but I'm not sure what else you might expect. They do a nice thing where they have the art style for the Punisher stay the same throughout the book. So it contrasts with the um, Riverdale um, look, let's say, the way Archie and his gang are drawn. So that's, uh, that's an interesting thing to have in there, and that sort of keeps your attention a little bit. There's a funny bit at the end where Archie goes, so I suppose now we can call on you if ever there's a problem? And the Punisher's basically like, no, no, I don't think so, mate. Uh, which which I quite liked. He just, he just shuts him down straight away because that's the cliched end of this there. They would otherwise be buddies. Okay, so did you like the book? Is it one you've read? Is it one you were thinking of getting? As I said, I would only get this if you intend to get it in a sale such as on Comixology, something like that. I'm not sure if it's released in a tangible paper format anymore or what its value is um, if you can get a copy. Uh, please feel free to like and subscribe and thanks for watching.